Welcome everybody to another episode of Cook Like a Champion. Oh, oh, oh. Boom! Oh, boom! Look at that, give a Look little shake. I am the um, assistant director of Casa Alba Melanie Hispanic Resource Center. Well, my real name is Yvonne Lawson, better known as Granny. I work for We All Rise. My name is Tara, and I'm an Asian American advocate for um, the Asian American community here in Green Bay. My name is Rogelio Contreras. I'm the community mobilizer for Wello, and we are here to not just promote as much as the culture and promote the Spanish Heritage Month, but also the farmers. Honored that I don't have to cook today, uh -huh. you know, and I can get That's some authentic mix out. <laughs> and then what I like to do is throw a little bit on the counter, okay. let them know that you're in the kitchen cooking, you know what I'm saying? Okay. If you don't make a mess, they ain't gonna take you for real. So this one, the blue tap on it, there is, um, whew. That's a party. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the vegetables that Willow uh, delivers uh, every other Friday. Onion. Uh, and then I'll make my little lettuce wrap over here. So we're just gonna cut that in half. Uh, yes. Um, I got Miss Granny in the kitchen. So this is no longer cooked like a champion. This is cooked like Granny. We got some cod right here. Yeah, we got some tilapia in the back. Oh yeah. That's my favorite salad right yeah, there. Man, we're just gonna add veggies. Right to the side. This is healthy. And you guys say flambe? Flambe. Flambe, that's how flambe. we roll it. Bring the culture together, bring the food together, bring the music together. And let's eat together. And let's eat together. So today, I'm gonna actually test you on your pronunciation. Oh, God. So yeah, this time we're using avocado oil. It adds a lot of flavor to it. Oh, it looks so fresh. We actually found out that jicama is super easy to grow in here. The cactus, what we did is we cooked them a little bit before. And chicharron taco with blue corn tortillas. Adds a lot of color to it. For example, cilantro, that's a family of cilantro. And you use that for if you have a fever or if you're feeling a little bit under the weather. Hmong farmers make up about 60% of the farmer's markets in town. And then cut it in half. And then... So the Scoville level um, of spiciness for the Thai chili peppers, that's over 100,000 Scoville units. Chayote is eaten in all different types of ethnic, ethnic cuisines. So we made two different versions of a hot pot, one with some spicy pork, one vegetarian. And all make sure you stay positive, positive in the kitchen, kitchen and know that you too can cook like a champion. champion.